What's up guys? Molly here from GhostVolta.com. Today I'm going to show you how to manually sideload apps from your Android phone or tablet onto your Ouya. It's not very difficult, but there are a number of steps, so let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so first things first, you're going to need to download a file manager onto your phone. Now, any file manager should work. I happen to use Astro File Manager and it worked just fine. I'll link that down below for the video. Once you go ahead and get that downloaded, you're going to swipe the screen to the left. Then you're going to get this screen. Then you're going to hit Application Manager. And then this screen is going to show up and you're going to browse through to see what apps you want to sideload. Once you find it, you're going to click on those three dots. And then a screen like this will show up. And then you're going to want to hit Backup. Now, once you've done that, you're going to want to connect your phone to your computer. You're going to want to go into your phone's storage device onto your computer. And then you're going to go look for backups, click on that folder, and then click on apps. And then you're going to find the APK for the app that you wanted to backup. And then you're going to want to go ahead and drag that onto your desktop since that's the easiest place to find it. Now it's time to get a file manager for your Ouya. Again, I went with the Astro file manager. And in order to do that, you need to go to your Ouya browser. Now to get there, you want to go to make software, and then the browser should be there. You use the built-in trackpad on your Ouya controller to move around your mouse, and then you press Y to bring up the URL bar, and then I just typed in Astro File Manager and got to the website. Uh, make sure that you download the version 3 uh, and not version 4. Then once it's installed, you want to go to Manage, then go down to System, and then hit Advanced. And then you want to scroll down to Storage. And then down to Downloads. And then you should see the file there. So you want to click on that, and then hit Install. And then you're good to go with the file manager. So then you can open up that and go through all that nonsense. Now it's time to connect your Ouya to your computer, which you can do by using your phone's cord that you used earlier. Once your Ouya is connected to your computer, it will essentially work like your phone did. So you want to go into your Ouya's storage system, and then you want to drag that APK file over into your Ouya's storage system, and then you're good to go with that. So now that your APK file is on your Ouya, you want to go back to the Ouya file manager. And you do that by going to Make, Software, and then you'll see the file manager there. You want to open that up, go to Manage My Files, and then you'll see the applications or that you loaded from your phone. So you want to click on the ones you want, hit install. Then once it's installed, you want to restart your Ouya. Once your Ouya restarts, you want to go to Make Software, then you'll see the app there. Go ahead and load it up. Now, it's important to state that unless your games are purchased from the Ouya store, you cannot guarantee that they'll be compatible with your Ouya controller. Some of them you can only use the mouse trackpad. Some of them you can use the controller. So just keep that in mind before you start siloading all your apps. Hopefully this was helpful to you. Uh, if you are interested in learning how to download the Amazon App Store under your Ouya, be sure to click the link below. Be sure to head over to GhostVolta.com, sign up on our forums. We've got a lot of cool stuff over there. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys later.